right? Most of this, right? This is all getting pushed out. Longtime Jackson College professor Pat Visser is retiring after more than two decades of inspiring students. Pat's fascination with science started early on. I had a set of childcraft encyclopedias when I was a kid that explained all kinds of things and my mom loves telling the story of me coming in going, okay, I finished. I had read the entire set from you know, one end to the other and I read Red Cross first aid manuals, nursing manuals as 10, 11 year old kid. I was just fascinated with how the body worked. Despite her early interest in education. When I was in fourth grade, I became a teacher assistant for the special ed teacher at my elementary school. Pat initially resisted the idea of becoming a teacher. And it was great fun. People always ask me if I'd be a teacher because my mom's whole side of the family were teachers. I'm like, mm, no, no way. I am not going to be a teacher. Because to me, teaching meant, you know, elementary, junior high, you know, high school. I'm like, mm, that's not my personality. <laughs> but her perspective changed during college while tutoring. One of my tutoring students looked at me one day and said, why aren't you planning to become a college professor? Students need people who can explain things like you do. I was like, mm, little light bulb went off. Oh, this kind of teaching I really, really like. And that was the end of that. And I started prepping to be able to be a college professor. For 21 years at Jackson College, Pat primarily taught anatomy and physiology, finding a special connection with community colleges through her father's work with the State of Michigan Education Department. And it's been one of the fun things because I never know when I walk into a class for the first time the kinds of students that I'm going to have. Some of them have been in the military, some have been paramedic, some have been homemakers for, you know, 20 years. I'm like, I haven't cracked a book since I was 16. Teen, you know, I have no idea what I'm doing, you know, when they're petrified and helping them realize that they can learn. It's just a lot of variety and it's been a lot of fun that way. Pan has taught countless students over the years and recalls one who struggled initially but made a remarkable turnaround. I can still vividly picture in my mind being in class one day and I was explaining a concept and I saw the light go off in his face. All the little things just clicked. Pat stayed at Jackson College because of the community and relationships she built with her students. You get to know students and you get to know their lives and what's going on with them and you, know, you sympathize with them, you give them the shoulder to cry on when they're having a really bad day and you can boost them up. A really good environment you know, to work in. I really enjoyed it. While she'll miss the students and the camaraderie, Pat is looking forward to retirement. Missing meetings? No. <laughs> <laughs> Missing grading papers? Mm, no. But the people, yeah. Definitely. Her future includes more gardening, reading, music, and travel. She plans to write a science applications workbook merging chemistry with health science. I'll keep the academic side of my mind uh, still working, but I'm going to give myself time to do a whole bunch of other things that I have not had as much time to do as I wanted to do.